my bed. Where's my phone? I'm not even gonna lie. I'll spend the first eight hours of my day on my phone on TikTok. Today, I just was like, I just been randomly getting into like vlogging and sometimes it'd be daily. Sometimes, you know, I just like to keep things fresh. Look at my case though, y'all. Comment down below that you love my case and that you are in love with this case. This case is so nice. I have to be somewhere in 45 minutes and I have not even gotten up to get ready yet. So you guys already know the routine. Make the bed, open the blinds. Let's get to it. I was definitely planning on going to the gym, but not this morning because I have 45 minutes to get ready. I feel like on days where I'm rushing or some days I'll hit these points in my routines where I'm kind of like, do I really want to do this? Do I feel like doing this? But those are the days I push through. Like, I'm gonna be honest today, I don't really wanna, I've already read my daily devotional, but today I really don't really wanna read my affirmations and I don't know why, I just feel that way. Some days I just feel that way. Some days I just spend all day in bed. My muscles are really tense. I feel like I really want like a massage, like a deep tissue massage or something. Like, I don't know, my body just feels very tense. And whenever I'm stressing, cause I still have anxiety every now and then, but I can talk my way out of it into more of a to more of a tranquil mindset, but sometimes my anxiety be excruciating. But I feel like I already brushed my teeth. I think I did already. But we're gonna get to these affirmations. Today is going to be a good day. Today I choose happiness. I believe in myself. I am kind. Today is a fresh start. I deserve to be loved. I am creative. Today I will learn and grow. Um, amazing things are gonna happen. I am grateful for all I have. I see beauty in everything. I am more than enough. You deserve good things. I love you. I love my body and my skin no matter the season that it's in. I'm a beautiful being inside and out. I am God's creation. I am love and I am love from the one up above. That A! I just wanna do the TikTok hips. This one routine is gonna be lit. <laughs> okay, let's get this skincare routine going. You guys already know I love it. One thing I will say to you guys is, the more you do something, the more you wanna do something. I don't think I've honestly missed a skincare routine in like almost like a year. Or if I have, it's like very uncommon of me. But let's go in with this first. Please don't be mad at me. I'm trying my hardest, but I think I'm gonna wear like this. You probably have seen me wear this a bunch, but it's just kind of like, come on. And then I'm gonna wear these. And then for some reason, I want to wear like lime green Converse. Oh yeah, have I ever showed you like, this book? This book is so cute. It's called I Am Me, A Book of Authenticity. This is random, that's random, but just wanted to show y'all. When I snap my fingers, I am going to be in, wait, let me see if I can go back more. When I snap my fingers, I'm going to be in the outfit in three, two, do you guys like this? I think it's pretty cool. I don't know. I feel like my vibe today, I've been, I, I, I'm in a more like chill vibe, but I definitely do have to go get some stuff done. And I kind of want to shop today too. I'm gonna see what Zach is doing today and I might go on like Melrose and shop, but I may look through Pinterest and see what I want to do first for the day. But also too, it's just like, I have to leave like now. Well, okay you guys, I am about to get ready to leave out. Let me find a fragrance. I'm gonna wear this today, the French waltz. It just, I just like the way it smells. I just called my Uber and now I am about to see what book am I reading next. I think most likely I'm gonna read David Goggins can't hurt me just because like I heard it's a really good read and like you know I just want to hear more of his story but for right now I am watch I am listening to his podcast episode with Ed Millett and I am excited for that because uh, do you ever see like business or motivation gurus on YouTube and stuff like I've always wanted to go to like a conference where they spoke at and they like they talk about like business and entrepreneurship so hopefully I might be going to one of those soon so we will see and I'll keep you guys updated on it but you guys know I haven't got like a new DR lip oil and it looks so cool but it's like like it has like a, it had like a yellow glow to it. It has like an orange glow. The last one had like a pink glow to it, and I just kind of was confused. I was like, did I do something wrong? But no, I didn't. Let's get out of here. Let's go to this. I'm going to a meeting. I'm about to leave out, but I wanted to show y'all this right quick. I wanted to show y'all this. So normally, whenever I wear my AirPod Maxes, I have to clean them up because my ears are dirty coming out of the gym, especially when you're like sweating and stuff. So I do this just so that it's like. Cause I get bumps on my ears really easily or like around them. I also need to do dishes. 
a lot of stuff to do today. A lot of little small things I need to do to just really get my life together. Oh, they're going dead. All right, let me put them on the charger now and then so that when I come back, they'll be charged. Okay, let me grab a banana because I haven't eaten breakfast yet, but I do need to leave. Let's get out of here. I always feel like whenever I leave out of my house, I'm, it smells like pee. I always feel like every time I leave out of my house that my neighbor is going to come and be like, you're too loud. I can hear you making TikToks all night. Because that's literally all I do is make TikToks. Okay, I'm going to see you guys later. You guys, I'm back at a place called Dialogue Cafe. It's my favorite place in LA. And I got my normal go-to meal, which is the dipping waffles. I am nine times out of 10 and about to watch a podcast while I eat my food. And I may or may not go book shopping, even though I have a thousand books. Four thousand books, 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 books. I have a thousand books. But I'm just really excited. I just came from a meeting and I just, I just feel so inspired and I feel God just saying like, everything you ever want is gonna come to life. So just stay on alert. So I'm telling you guys to stay on alert. My neck is hurting for some reason. I don't know why my neck is hurting. I didn't even show y'all that I was at the bookstore, but I'm back. I see this book right here called Grief is Love. And I am actually inspired. I'm trying to see what else I wanna read because I have like 40 books to read at home. But it's just like, it's like once I buy the book, it's no fun. So let me get home. I just got back from the bookstore and I literally like came and just sat and was scrolling on TikTok and my body feels still feel very tense. And I really just want to sleep the rest of the day away because I really was just scrolling on TikTok after my meeting. So I really don't know what I'm going to do. I got a new book in the mail and it came in like a gigantic, as a gigantic size. And I just was thinking about how much I love just vlogging my little day. I wish I had someone to follow me around all day though to like vlog, but it's just fun too. I like just holding my camera and I just love making videos but i am like really sore me and zach are going to we're going to go get clothes and we're going to go shop and i'm looking at my signal that says you are a king so i'm kind of distracted and i'm also just i need to plan out content like what do what do i want to post what do i want you guys to see from me make sure you guys let me know that down below in the comments i'm looking at my videos and stuff and everything has been doing pretty good okay so i'll see you guys in a little bit i'm at the legendary Alfreds. about to get a coffee it's about to be real cute I'm about to get me a coffee um and i'm just too excited period look you guys this is the book i'm starting too i've been trying to time myself on how long it takes me to read i'm gonna try to read this book only by itself so that'll be really fun and it's just fun in here and we're just in alfred's and we're just living our lives we're slipping that jacket is what's like the name of this brand Iro. Yeah, we call it Eero. 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 that's that reminds me of like sub zero look at this right here i feel like um i've seen like manu reels or something similar like this and it's like really cute I like this. This is a size. What size is this leather piece? You know, like you, you know, like Chrome okay. Hearts have like something similar to that right here. Oh, I'm gonna look around a little bit more for some more stuff. Hello, you guys. My name is Aaron Tanala, but you guys look at the bags in here. I just like walking around in these type of stores. Oh. No, I didn't. Do you have this? Does this come in different colors or is this the only shade? That, that is the only color that This is a nice color. Now. I'm gonna get y'all for my girl here. It's like, just come out and show us. You put on a piece. She's like, show me. It's reversible. Oh, so I like that. Oh, it's reversible? This is a nice brand. This is, look, I feel it. It's Prada Do. Wow. Okay, you guys. I'll be back. So we are on the way to Raisin Cane. We have Tati in the back. Now everybody acting like we're standing up from here to here. La la la. Alright, I'ma see y'all at Kane's. Just made it to Kane's. Oh, I need to get a massage. My body is sore. I'm kind of in pain. But today has been a very beautiful and blessed day. I'm just so thankful for to be alive. Tati and Zach are back there. And yeah, I just have to make sure I don't get hit by a car. I think I'm gonna get like a Kaniac. What is your order? Can you let the camera know what's your order? I get the biggest one, the Kaniac box. <laughs> <laughs> what do you get, Zach? I get the same thing. Oh, I'm gonna get a Big Mac and super size my fries. Wait, I wonder how the chicken sandwich tastes. Oh, you work that Kings. How does this feel coming here? What do you mean, how does it feel? Like now that you're just like an influencer and now you're going to like one of your like old. They, they, they fire me, so. Oh. 
if you're in a bad, it can't sit with me. We just got to the Grove, and I am about to get, I have to really pee and like poop all at the same time. I think we're gonna get like some, I'm not getting any more books, I bought books today. I'm gonna give you a haul when I get home. I don't even know what I'm about to do. You guys, I really want some Prada loafers, but I told myself I gotta, I gotta keep the grind up more first. <laughs> Came to Zara to look and for clothes. I'm lip fillers. No, you're not, Tati. Show the camera. Y'all, I'm getting lip fillers. We are in Zara with the queen Tati herself. Let's go. Oh, oh look at the dog. Okay, How much I have to pay? 5000 5000 Are you Are you serious? A 30 second appearance. 30 second appearance? 5000 How much did you pay for your braids? 5000 You paid 5000 for your braids? <laughs> <laughs> you paid 5000 for those? Come on, please. I'm not in the mood. My stomach hurt. Like, <laughs> you sound like my mama. About to leave you guys. Oh. Uh, bye, <laughs> vlog. Bye, vlog. We had a great Say time, bye. Bye. Have a See safe you later, um, Tati. Okay, y'all. Let's get the business. I am now officially back home. I have a few things to do. I have to get some footage together. I'm going somewhere soon, so I need to make sure I'm just like prepared. Um, let me make sure all of these things are put together so team I could have more vlogs up and I'm just excited to be posting way more just because I love posting way more way more way more and I'm just the king of YouTube so whenever you hear my name you hear me say that I'm the king of YouTube okay now let's see what we need to do don't worry you guys I got this I'm gonna give you guys a book haul in a second too so let me go get these books real quick I am about to watch a podcast and fold up all my clothes but before I do that I'm gonna show y'all all of my new books that I got today and the ones that came in the mail I really do do, don't get me wrong, you guys. I do want to decorate my apartment, but I'm gonna wait until I move because I'm moving soon. So, okay, so we have two books. We have My Year of Rest and Relaxation, and I know that this is a really good book. I heard. Then I have Grief is Love. So I think I may read this. I think on the plane, or at least try to. So I'm gonna bring this book because I'm packing tonight too. So I'm bringing this book and I'm also gonna bring, um, what else am I gonna bring? I'm also gonna bring like, Stay Hard. I mean, Can't Hurt Me. I'm gonna bring this book as well. So I'm gonna bring both of these and I'm gonna just piggyback off of the, both one or the other. Then I also have this book. It's called The Language of Emotions. And this is a book that talks about like, literally just emotion. So that is very fun. And then I have, what is this, my receipt? Okay, I have that. Okay, these are the clothes that I have to fold. So let's bring these. I've been loving vlogging. I'm a vlog master. Okay, we have all of these clothes to fold and we still have to pack. I'm not overwhelmed or anything just because I know I can get this stuff done. It's just all about getting it done and doing it. And I actually like folding up my clothes. Like I just remember feeling like I always had to fold up me and my brother's clothes because me and my brothers, we used to share clothes when I used to live with my mom. And I do kind of miss it because you obviously know like my brother, I do miss my brother a lot, so. I would go back and fold clothes for all of us in a heartbeat. Oh, why did I feel like I wanted to cry just now? But, um, yeah, so this is always like amazing. When I'm folding my own clothes though, but I'm not gonna lie though, if I was back home trying to fold clothes, I don't know what I would be doing. Like I always, I never like, I never like to do chores whenever it was forced on me. Like if I was forced to do chores, I just never really liked it. Like I know for sure right now, I need to clean my bathroom. I need to vacuum my room one more time. And I also need to set up my I need to set up my bookshelf just because like I haven't set it up yet. And what I've been trying to f focus on lately is just like when I'm re like, I just want to get my time back. I feel like I spend so much time on social media whenever I'm not even posting or creating or even working. Just kind of get down on myself. Cause I'd be like, why are you on your phone so much? But then I also forget that sometimes it's literally my job. So it's like, I can't be too hard on myself. Cause it's like, this is how I make a living for myself. But at the same time, it's like, boy, put that phone down. I'm gonna let you guys, I'm gonna put it in two times speed just so that this can give you motivation to clean your room. So. Get up and clean your room while you watch this vlog, while you watch the rest of this vlog. And yeah, just be cute. But I'm about to finish watching this. Working and doing stuff all day. Right now I am getting, I'm putting dishes in the dishwasher and I'm almost done putting up clothes. I need to shower and then I'm only leaving. I'm going somewhere for only like three days, two days. And don't worry you guys, I will vlog the whole thing. We have that done. My bleach is untopped. We don't have much left to do. We just need to, what's left now is to, I only have like a mouthful of clothes to put up. And then I need to shower. So I'll come back to you guys whenever I'm done with everything. I am fresh out of the shower and this pimple, I'm gonna put a pimple patch over it. I am about to, I'm almost three fourths done packing. 
But you guys, guess what happened? So I left my um, ID at my friend's house that stays maybe 30 minutes away. So I have to go there now, actually, and I have to go and retrieve my ID or I will not be, be able to fly. Three fourths pack. Um, let me put a pimple patch on. I will keep you guys updated about everything, but I think I'm gonna call it a night. This, let me put my, let me go and put a pimple patch on my forehead right quick. I just put my pimple patch on, but I just wanna say I love you guys all so much. And before I go crazy, let me go and finish handling all the rest of these little things that I have to do. I love you so much, and I'll keep you updated on the travel.